Good afternoon, dear guests and subscribers of the channel. Today I want to show you how you can factory reset the USB hardware of DG Anywhere USB routers. This can come in handy when you receive this equipment from someone and the old configuration is left on it, or you just want to roll everything back, such scenarios are also very likely. There are at least three methods that will help restore these USB routers to factory settings. First, through the physical reset button on the device itself. Second, via web interface. Third, through Telnet connection. Let's take a closer look at each of them below. Before we start, I'll ask you to subscribe to the channel and put your thumbs up, it's not difficult for you, but it's a great motivation for me. Thank you in advance. This method is probably the most basic, especially when you can't use the other two. Here you do not need to know the login and password, and even the IP address of the device, but from the minuses, this is a mandatory physical presence, this is critical when the equipment is located at a remote site. Each DG Anywhere USB device has a small, inconspicuous reset button. To use it, you need a paper clip. Power on the DG Anywhere USB. You will start to flash one of the indicators, immediately hold down the reset button with a paper clip. Your device will start flashing all the lights in orange and hold it for 15 to 20 seconds. Release the reset button and wait for the device to boot. Log into your DHCP server to find the correct IP address and continue configuring the DG hardware. Reset DG Anywhere USB via web interface. This method is very friendly because you do not need to be physically present at the location where the device is located. You enter the web interface in the factory default settings item, you must click on the restore button. After that, your device will reboot. Reset DG Anywhere USB via Telnet. DG devices have the ability to control through the terminal. To do this, you must know the exact connection port. You can view it in the web interface, go to the Network Configuration Network Services Settings section, here you will see if the Enable Telnet Serve option is activated and what connection port it has. Next, you can either install the built-in Telnet client on Windows or use PuTTY, whichever is more convenient for you. After hitting the terminal on the device. In the terminal, enter boot action equals factory. And just press enter, just wait for the device to reboot. Here are some simple methods to return DG family devices to factory settings. Thank you for watching and for liking this video.